Hello everybody, this is Lori from Journals from the Attic here to share with you my carpet bagger journal that I made uh, following the course from Nick the Booksmith. Um, the cover is full of lace and textiles, some sorry silk. I am calling this journal Discover. Um, it has hand-sewn buttons, um, some um, coffee dyed cheesecloth, um, some sewing. Um, it is closed with some seam binding. So let's open it up. On this front cover, I used some marbled paper from Graphics Fairy and I did sew around it. There's also a definition of what a carpet bagger is. Uh, here's a picture from Tim Holt's collection of three little boys and a letter that these three little boys, one of them may have sent to the person who owns this journal. Um, there's some book pages, there's some sewing throughout, some stenciling, um, and the paper is coffee dyed. There's half sheet here with some collaging and a vintage book card and a vintage game piece card. And turn it over. This is a vintage page from a book and then some a tuck spot here with a guest check and a Rolodex card and a library card that can be used as journaling. A book page with some collaging. Here is some um, textile sorry silk with some cheesecloth under it and some buttons sewn on with by hand. A couple tickets that maybe this person had saved after they had been to a show or a carnival. A uh, page of book, a half sheet, some graph paper. This is a doily. I tried copy staining the doily, but when I did it lost all these gorgeous flowers on it. So that's why I've got it. Um, I just used some vintage photo. There's also some textile sewing here. This is an image from Graphics Fairy that I put on um, some vellum. Some more sewing with textiles on it. Um, stenciling again. This is some vintage ledger paper. A half sheet that has a bus ticket on it that this, this person may have saved. Um, this is the center of it. Um, some more um, hand sewing with some textiles on that half sheet. Uh, this is some, a number code with some collaging and some leaves that I punched out and um, inked up the other side of that vellum. I also made a couple of these little scrap packs that I put in here. And some more um, this is scrapbook paper on back of some textile. The other side of that piece of paper. Um, here is a wild violet that I had found and pressed and put in here. The person may have found it. Some sheet music. Um, this is some sewing stuff that I think is important for people to carry if they're carrying all their stuff around. There's some needles, some vintage button, some thread. Here's a telegram and just a blank piece of paper to use for another journaling spot that is just clipped on here. Um, and some more, some more hand sewing on this piece with some vintage material. Um, some more sewing here. And the back pocket has the other side of the marbled paper, then a, a invoice from old design shop and an inventory tag. So this will be on sale in my Etsy store with the link below. Thanks for watching.